temperature. We topped out 76, not our warmest day of the year. I believe that'll come in as second warmest. 60s to the north, 75. Carroll, Grinnell, you hit 75, 77 in Iowa City. Headed out on two wheels out there. East winds probably 5 to 15 miles an hour. 70s through 7 p.m. By 8 p.m. it cools off a bit, but not too quickly at 69. Clouds are thicker up in northern Iowa. The rest of us got some patchy sunshine. No precipitation out there. It doesn't look too active at this time, but there's definitely a weather maker on the way that is going to spin up in here. Some showers and thunderstorms may de develop along this warm front, and the low moves through and pulls the cold front through with thunderstorms developing along that. In behind, colder air and a lot of wind will be pushing in on Thursday. If you're traveling, a pretty good chance of wet weather from Kansas through Missouri up and through Wisconsin should be generally dry out in front of this with some very warm air in St. Louis and drying out with gusty winds in behind. You can see much colder air over South and North Dakota. So here we go hour by hour dry for most of us overnight. A few storms best chances North. It looks like the activity will fire again tomorrow around noon. Some storms northern Iowa. Then here comes the cold front. Scattered storms along that. They should push on out. Some storms will move in from northern Missouri. These could be strong. And then at this time, it looks like the system may move out by Thursday with some cold air and those winds in behind. Could be a, a few showers here and there. Severe weather risk tomorrow. The best chance looks to be a long Interstate 80 diving south to just west of I-35. The main threat at this time looks like potentially some damaging winds, but I think a little better threat of uh, uh, some uh, big hail out there. So here's your hail size chart. You get through a quarter, not going to cause too many problems. Once we get around ping pong ball size hail, that's where the problems develop and obviously the, the huge hail, but I'm not expecting it that big there. So the forecast tonight, 59 degrees, a few storms developing late out there. East southeast winds at 5 to 15. Tomorrow that forecast high 72 degrees storm teammate weather alert day because of the potential of a few severe storms south southwest winds at 10 to 20 miles an hour winds will get gusty on Thursday colder high 55 but look how quick we bounce back sunshine Friday Saturday Easter Sunday looks dry maybe a shower late cooler and then some 60s next week.